brilliant quotes by Saadi Shirazi about life, women, and wisdom. Be generous and pleasant-tempered and forgiving, even as gods. Scatter favors over thee, do thou scatter over the people. A grateful dog is better than an ungrateful man. When thou seest thine enemy in trouble curl, not thy whiskers in contempt, for in every bone there is marrow, and within every jacket there is a man. Whoever interrupts the conversation of others to make a display of his fund of knowledge makes notorious his own stock of ignorance. The bad fortune of the good turns their faces up to heaven, the good fortune of the bad bows their heads down to the earth. Take care what you say before a wall, as you cannot tell who may be behind it. Whatever is produced in haste goes hastily to waste. To pardon the oppressor is to deal harshly with the oppressed. A man of virtue judgment and prudence speaks not until there is silence. Roma abroad in the world and take thy fill of its enjoyments before the day shall come when thou must quit it for good. Every person thinks his own intellect perfect and his own child handsome. Patience accomplishes its object while hurry speeds to its ruin. Whatever makes an impression on the heart seems lovely in the eye. I fear God the most, but after him I fear those who don't fear him. Have patience. All things are difficult before they become easy. A wise man among the ignorant is as a beautiful girl in the company of blind men. Joy and sorrow, beauty and deformity equally pass away. If a piece of worthless stone can bruise a cup of gold, its worth is not increased, nor that of the gold diminished. It's no virtue to gain the whole world, just gain the heart of one person. Do good even to the wicked it is as well to shut a dog's mouth with a crumb. In the sea, there are countless treasures, but if you desire safety, it is on the shore. Forgiveness is commendable, but apply not ointment to the wound of an oppressor. When the belly is empty, the body becomes spirit, and when it is full, the spirit becomes body. You who feel no pain at the suffering of others, it is not fitting for you to be called human. If a gem falls into mud, it is still valuable if dust ascends to heaven it remains valueless. Virtue is in the mind, not in the appearance. Whoever acquires knowledge, but does not practice, it is as one who plows, but does not sow. Whatever makes an impression on the heart seems lovely in the eye. Two orders of mankind are the enemies of church and state the king, without clemency and the holy man without learning. Every leaf of the tree becomes a page of the book once the heart is opened and it has learnt to read. Make no friendship with an elephant keeper if you have no room to entertain an elephant. 
Religion is only in the service of the people. It is not in the rosary in the prayer carpet. A handsome woman is a jewel. A good woman is a treasure. Nothing is so good for an ignorant man as silence. And if he was sensible of this, he would not be ignorant. Publish not men's secret faults, for by disgracing them, you make yourself of no repute. People are crying up the rich and variegated plumage of the peacock, and he is himself blushing at the sight of his ugly feet. The best loved by God are those that are rich yet have the humility of the poor, and those that are poor and have the magnanimity of the rich. That sorrow, which is the harbinger of joy, is preferable to the joy, which is followed by sorrow. Ants fighting together will vanquish the lion. An enemy to whom you show kindness becomes your friend. I have never seen a man lost who was on a straight path. Whoever gives advice to a heedless man is himself in need of advice. No person learned the art of archery from me who did not in the end make me his target. The rose and the thorn and sorrow and gladness are linked together. Whoever recounts to you the faults of your neighbor will doubtless expose your defects to others. A traveler without knowledge is a bird without wing. Better is the sinner who hath thoughts about God than the saint who hath only the show of sanctity. Were the diver to think on the jaws of the shark, he would never lay hands on the precious pearl. Use a sweet tongue, courtesy and gentleness, and now mayest manage to guide an elephant by a hair. A little and a little collected together becomes a great deal. The heap in the barn consists of single grains and drop and drop make the inundation. None can be so true to your secret as yourself. However much you study, you cannot know without action. A donkey laden with books is neither an intellectual nor a wise man empty of essence. What learning has he whether upon him as firewood or book? To him, who is stinted of food, a boiled turnip will relish like a roast fowl. Whenever you argue with another wiser than yourself, in order that others may admire your wisdom, they will discover your ignorance. It is safer to be silent than to reveal one's secret to anyone and telling him not to mention it. All human beings are limbs of the same body. God created them from the same essence. If one part of the body suffers pain, then the whole body is affected. If you are indifferent to this pain, you cannot be called a human being.